a dangerous blood sucking insect is on the move. Now the kissing bug is usually found in warmer climates in different countries or in southern states like Texas and Arizona. Well, that appears to be changing. The CDC is now confirming cases in Delaware, Maryland, Pennsylvania and Virginia. Now there are concerns it might be establishing itself in Michigan. Experts say climate change is creating the ideal environment for the bug to migrate north. Now the kissing bug, it feeds on blood from animals or humans, and it's called the kissing bug because their bites are often found around the mouth. They usually hide during the day and they're very active at night. They bite people in the face, but the real danger isn't in the kissing bug's bite, but in its feces. When patients, um, you know, when they're sleepy and they, uh, you know, they rub the part where the skin is, or the insect has bitten them, they'll accidentally rub in the poop, which has the organism in it, into the uh, wound. And then that's how you get uh, Chagos disease. And from there, it extends from the skin into the bloodstream. And then on, uh, over a period of um, years, it, will, um, it can destroy the nerves that uh, feed your uh, various parts of your body, so your heart, uh, and your esophagus, your colon. Now, those who come in contact with the kissing bug may experience flu-like symptoms at first, then suffer from heart disease for as long as 10 years. Right now, experts say there's enough reason to believe those bugs could be anywhere in the north, so that includes here in Michigan. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention say there haven't been any confirmed cases in our state yet. Now, kissing bugs are most commonly found under porches, in piles of wood, or in outdoor dog houses. Experts say clean those areas regularly. Kissing bugs can hide in cracks and small crevices, so seal gaps or cracks around windows, doors, walls, or screens. That'll help keep them out.